a few months ago, we got a call from one of our caregivers who had been through the program and his son was in the hospital. It was COVID and it was a really stressful time for him. And he said, you'll never believe this, but I was really stressed out. Like I was having a hard time managing this and, you know, just trying to figure out the logistics of everything that was going on with my son's health. And I stopped and I, you know, practiced that skill from CARES. The CARES program here at SAC is a very highly interactive family support program. And we hope to empower parents who have children on the autism spectrum. We want to empower them and to develop like mental health support, things like that. One thing that is the essence of CARES is the idea that you can't pour from an empty cup. That's something we really focused on around building what would become CARES. Seeing the different parents talk to each other and their journeys and where they're at is very, you know, magical. And as a facilitator, to see them talk to each other in this isolating experience of being a caregiver of somebody with autism or another kind of developmental concern is very meaningful. It is important to realize that when your life changes from this autism diagnosis, you would have like a lot of emotions. And it's very common for these parents to feel isolated because they would feel that people would not understand their perspective. We're a community of fabulous people and we're backed by science, but we're powered by extraordinary people. And that's what keeps us going. And that's what hopefully will keep those caregivers going too.